Hey fams, welcome back to my channel. So today I am coming to you with another Christmas in July DIY challenge. We wanted to give you an encore so that you guys will be able to add your videos and be more creative and just get a chance to, you know, put your DIYs on there that you did not get to do in the last DIY challenge. So of course, she needs no introduction. My really good friend here on YouTube, Tamara Wilson, is my co-host again, and we had so much fun coming up with this DIY challenge encore. So be sure to subscribe to her channel. She does a lot of DIYs glam diys y'all her home is amazing her kitchen is incredible i love her kitchen um and she also does a lot of home decors on her channel she has uh, three boys and she is happily married to her hubster and i am super excited just to even know her she is incredible so make sure you guys go ahead and check out her channel it will be linked down in the description box as well as go ahead and subscribe to my channel it will be li linked down in the description box as well and the playlist um, will be linked down in the description box so I want you guys to enjoy the video and enjoy the music Hey guys, so for my first DIY project, um, we're doing Christmas ornaments, right? So I was inspired by Pinterest to come up with some really, really cool ideas. I just kind of take, took them and made them my own. So I really fell in love with this idea. Um, it's a Christmas ornament, but it's more personalized. And so I don't have anything that's personalized in terms of like with the names and everything for my family. So I wanted to go ahead and do something personal that would just be so momentous, right? So I went ahead and I got some um, lettering stencils from the Dollar Tree and some buttons from Walmart um, and some ribbons as well and I am putting all the letters kind of just spelling out the names of my kids and my husband and myself um, and I'm putting them on the buttons and hot gluing them on the ribbon so it turned out so sweet oh my goodness it's so classic and it really just reminds me of when I was a kid I don't know it just feels so nostalgic to me but I absolutely love it and I just needed to incorporate it into my farmhouse or my modern farmhouse style um, for Christmas this year so that's what I'm doing now and it turned out absolutely fantastic Been real. 
So if you are new to my channel, welcome. My name is Shoshana and I have two channels here on YouTube. My main channel that you are watching now, which is Regal Designs by Shoshana. Here I do a lot of DIYs and craft projects, home and seasonal decor, and thrifting videos. I do upload on Tuesdays and Thursdays at 12 noon here. And my second channel that I just started is my cleaning channel, The Cleaning Queen, which consists of loads of cleaning motivation, decluttering, and organization. I do upload over there on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays at 12 noon as well. So if you like what you see here and you love cleaning motivation, please consider subscribing to both channels. Make sure you double tap that bell so that you don't miss an episode that I upload. I also do have an Amazon store um, and I would love for you to go ahead and visit that store. I have tons of fall decor, Christmas decor, everyday decor, and everyday home essentials listed in my Amazon store. So I would love for you to go, ha go ahead and check those out. I will have everything linked down in my description box below. Thank you so much for your support. Isn't this just so gorgeous? I love the way that this turned out. Oh, I can't wait to incorporate it in my Christmas tree this year. So now I am on to DIY number two, and I'm just using some pine cones that I already had in my stash, and I'm going to be making different sizes um, of some ornaments, and some small, some mediums, and some really large ones. I actually do have tons of these, and I will be recreating these this DIY um, in the Christmas season so I am so happy that I was able to put this together because I just love the way that it looks and these pine cones I got them from Walmart a few years ago and they smell amazing they smell like cinnamon so my entire craft room was smelling like cinnamon it just it just smells so good so I know that um, you know you can purchase it in Walmart I will also have it linked down in my Amazon store you can also purchase it from there and you can use them all around your home I use them everywhere in my house and I'm just so glad that I'm going to be able to incorporate it on my Christmas tree this year and it's just going to just have all the senses just going wild <laughs> so I'm so excited about this DIY project one horse open sleigh Over the fields we go Laughing all the way Bells on bobtails ring Making spirits bright What fun it is to laugh and sing A sleighing song tonight Oh, jingle bells, jingle bells Jingle all the way Oh, what fun it is to ride In a one horse open sleigh Jingle bells, jingle bells
I hope that you guys are enjoying this video. Thank you so much for all the participants that is taking part in this DIY challenge. I am so excited about it. Don't forget that it is every Thursday in the month of July um, that you can upload your DIY videos. I will have the playlist ready for you guys so that you can go ahead and upload. I am super excited and cannot wait to watch everyone's videos. Thank you so much Tamara girl for co-hosting with me. This has been such a blast and we're only halfway through it so I am so excited. Be sure to go ahead and check out Tamara's channel. It will be linked down below in the description box where you can go and watch her video and a plethora of other awesome videos that she has um, on her channel and don't forget to visit the playlist as well. So I would love for you guys to go ahead and give this video a thumbs up if you like what you see here Please share and comment down below because I do love talking with you all Thank you so much again for watching and for participating and for supporting our DIY challenge here for Christmas in July I will see you in the next DIY episode and thank you once more Bye guys and happy or merry Christmas in July